little bit of a shorter comic review, I hope. Um, Batman Gates of Gotham, it takes place in an era I like. I've mentioned it before, when Dick Grayson is Batman, Robin is Damian Wayne, Batman's real son, from Talia Ghul. Uh, this one had Red Robin in it. It had... Um, who was, Tim was Red Robin. Yeah, it had all the Robin. It had a Black Bat in it, who was Cassandra Kane, who used to be a Batgirl. Um, and it dealt with one of my favorite subjects, which is the history of Gotham. I don't know why I like the history of Gotham. I don't like the history of Krypton. I don't like the history of Themyscira. don't like the history of Atlanta, or Atlantis. But I like Gotham history with the Waynes and the Cobblepots. And I don't even mind that they added the uh, Elliots into the royal families of Gotham. Um, this brought in a new one that they retroed into a new family. It just wasn't a good story. I don't know what it was. It, it's all the stuff I like. I just didn't find... And Scott Snyder's not a bad writer. Um, it just... I don't know. I don't recommend you going out to pick this up. Um, if you see... It's again, if you see a... It, it's a it's a trade, so... I don't know. You see it for a buck or two. It's a read. It's a, it's a Batman story. Uh, the one story in the very back of the book... Is worth a buck, I would say. It's um, it's the origin of a Batman in France as they're getting ready. This is around two thousand five or seven, I'm guessing, in the year our years, not in comic book years, but in our time. Uh, it would have come out before two ten. This was when Bat, just before Batman Incorporated came out. So Batman, it had, it just had a story of Batman recruiting different Batmans around the world. This was a French Batman. It was a good story. I Just that story alone is worth the price of, if you see it on sale, used, ratty copy, buy it. It uh, shouldn't cost you more than a buck or two. That's about what it's worth. Um, and there you go. It's a short but succinct comic review.